Hello everyone, I'm Tronic. Uh, I'm going to introduce a new shader plugin for Maya. The name of the plugin is Ruins. Uh, the most important difference between Ruins and the Maya shader effect is simulation performance. Ruins supports NVIDIA Fixes and the CUDA acceleration technology. Uh, it means the simulation performance of Ruins will much faster than Maya shader effect. Now let me show you how to use Ruins. First, I'm going to create a polygon cylinder model. So, uh, go to create polygon primitives and uh, select a cylinder. Okay, now um, create a cylinder right here and uh, scale. Scale it. And then um, put the cylinder to here. Okay. Now I have to clean all history and the free uh, transformation of uh, this cylinder. So go to freeze transformations and uh, go to delete delete uh, delete O by type and the delete history. Okay. Now uh, go to ruins and uh, create debris and uh, turn on its option setting window. Okay, uh, now you can see uh, Ruins provides a lot of options for user. Uh, for example, CUDA shader option or uh, precision shader option or uh, random shader option. Uh, I'm going to introduce CUDA shader option. Uh, CUDA shader option is a spatial op option because um, it uses NVIDIA fixes and the CUDA acceleration technology. It means uh, you can get a better simulation performance if you are the user of NVIDIA video card. Uh, but you can use other options to create debris uh, such as precision shader or random shader. However, I'm going to use CUDA shader. So, uh, select uh, select a cylinder here and uh, uh, turn on CUDA shader option and uh, click CUDA shader. Okay, and then turn on outliner. You will see about uh, 15 degrees right here. But uh, I want uh, I want more debris, so select one debris and uh, click CUDA shader again. Uh, okay, you can see uh, you get more debris here. Uh, so you can do as many as you can. You will get more debris uh, right here. So uh, click CUDA shader again, and then. Repeat to uh, repeat to click CUDA shader and uh, repeat and uh, select click again. Then click again and click again. Then click again. Oh, it's too huge, so click again. Select. Okay. Mm. Click again. Oh, it's too huge. Click again. Click. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, click again. Oh, it's so huge. So click again. Uh, okay. Uh, click again. Okay. You will see you get a lot of debris right here. Okay. Now um, I'm going to set the end frame of the time slider. 
uh, so I set the end frame to uh, 150 and then set uh, the playback speed to uh, play every frame free okay so uh, now uh, turn off the option setting window okay you can select all degrees and then create uh, create a group and then name it cool.grp okay now uh, you can select all degrees again and uh, go to drawings create active region body okay now we can click play button Ooh, you will see this uh, you will see the result like this but uh, this result is not a, uh, is not what I want so I need a collision plane I, I mean I need an object to be the collider so um, go to ruins and uh, set a creation call, uh, create a collision plane okay you will get a plane like this now uh, play again see okay um, that's the result what I want okay